Please welcome writers of the future judge, Dr. Greg Benford, and illustrators of the future judge, Laura Brody and Freeze. In our next story, Sailing the Sky Sea, survivors aboard a damaged, morphing sky city struggle to keep from plunging into the cloudy depths of a gas giant. The author, Geir Lenneskog, was born in Norway, but moved to the US when he was a child. Almost five years ago, he stubbornly began submitting a story every quarter to the Writers of the Future contest, and also entered his artwork in the Illustrators of the Future contest and won on his first entry. It took him 18 consecutive entries before he won the writer's contest for his gritty science fiction survival story. Please congratulate Geir Lanesko. those guys were going to be there, I'd make everything in an upside-down space wreck. Um, now I have bookends. It, it took a really long time, and uh, it taught me never to quit and always to do my best. I'd like to thank my wife, Karen, for putting up with me, as I do both art and illustration in most of my free time. And I do try to at least once every day crawl out of my hole and say hi to her. <laughs> I've learned a lot this week. It's been great. Um, based on the essays of L. Ron Hubbard and uh, all the inspiration from the teachers and authors and winners that have, that have come to speak to us, I've learned that I can do more than the narrow writing that I have been doing. And I think we've all learned that. We've learned how we can expand into other realms of speculative fiction and enjoy the writing work. Um, I'd really like to thank L. Ron Hubbard for conceiving of this contest and Arthur Services and Galaxy Press for continuing to give us a really great experience. Thank you. Good evening. In first grade, Joey Jordan's teacher informed her mother, your daughter is going to be a great artist. Nurture and support her in this the best you can. Well, nevertheless, Joey has worked in horse stables, a cedar shake mill, and a film development warehouse, and spent eight years in the Army and the National Guard where she was a tank turret repairer. It's truth. Her artwork spotlights a focal character in crisis, and her illustration for Sailing the Sky Sea encapsulates a planetary war into a personal snapshot. Please congratulate Joey Jordan. Um, got my magic speech paper. It turned you all into my fellow workshop classmates. <laughs> um, yeah, uh, this is just the start of this wonderful journey. Um, I'd like to thank my husband, Sean, in the crowd here, uh, who helped build a studio area for me to work so that uh, I could get away from the distractions of the, our beautiful, wonderful children, Ashlyn and Riley. <laughs> Um, our friends and family that couldn't be here with us today, but they're watching live, too. <laughs> um, yeah. Uh, <laughs> I'd like to thank L. Ron Hubbard for the creation of this wonderful idea, this awesome dream to help authors and illustrators of fantasy and science fiction to make their way into the field and be professionals. 
I plan to come back when I can to the future events to share what I've done during this time and things that I've learned and when you yourselves are up here uh, to pay it forward to the next group of writers and illustrators. I'd like to thank those of Authors Services for all the hard work that they've put into this, all the information that we've gained from this and how they made everything run so smoothly and fun for us. Um, it's just awesome here. <laughs> Uh, and last but not least, the guest speakers and our instructors. I'd use the word awesome again, but somebody's going to turn it into a drinking game. <laughs> yeah. The instructors were all such great teachers. I've learned so much from them in this time that I've been here. From your years of experience, uh, experiences and your uh, tests and trials, uh, the things and techniques that may have taken me years to dabble with, I can now go home and actually apply. And I know if I have questions in the future, I can actually look them up and ask. Because in a way, they've actually always been my instructors. From the days that I used to collect their little art cards and the, the book covers that I would sit there and try to sketch. <laughs> uh, to the tips that they've taught me just recently in the workshops. Also, I'd like to thank my classmates. You guys are all awesome, too. Um, yay. <laughs> thank you. <laughs>